Hi all, welcome back to another video. Today we will be talking about deduplication rules provided by the Odo 16 data cleaning module. Most businesses get data from various resources for any purpose. For example, if you are running a lead campaign, you will receive data from multiple resources such as Facebook, LinkedIn, etc. Using these resources, you can bring the data into one specific entity and it may create duplication chances. All the duplicated documents are identified easily and removed with the help of deduplication rules. Deduplication allows record filtering and deleting and shows an approximate threshold of similar data. Now, let's see what's inside the data cleaning deduplication rules. So, once you open the data cleaning module, you can see a menu which is a configuration menu. Open that. And under the configuration, you have three different rules which are deduplication, recycle records and field cleaning. So, we'll be opening the deduplication. So here you can see the contact, which is a rule. These are all rules created. If you want, you can click on create and create a new one. So this is one which I have created. So I'll show how a deduplication rule takes its name. See, I'm choosing the model contact. So the rule is taking the name of the model which we choose. Okay, until and unless you change it. It will remain same as the name of the model and next you have the domain here so if you want this rule to be applied based on a particular filter you can just keep the domain here okay and here we have the cross company duplication around various countries is suggested for you by activating the cross company and here we have the merge mode which is manual and automatic and so we have chosen manual here here you have notify user I'm choosing a user which is Michelle admin so here you have to choose the user who should be notified while merging it manually and how often so here you have days weeks and months you can choose it from here and here you are setting this rule to be active so currently it's active here we have a space to specify the rules so the first unique field should be address contact address and the other one I'm giving name okay so only merge if they are exact match so I'm saving this record and here you can see a deduplicate button so it's not yet time to click that let's go back open the contact module and let's create two contacts with the same name Let's try clicking so I have clicked the contacts here and here I'm creating a new contact I'm giving a name as Tony and just giving the name alone saving it creating one more contact named Tony and saving it so currently we have two contacts named Tony let's see so here you can see two Tony's okay now let's go back to the data cleaning go to configuration deduplication and open our rule click on the deduplicate so here you can see the duplicates that's the contact which we created right now both tawnies have come here here you can see the similarity between these two okay it's 96 percentage similar either you can merge it or discard it so let's merge it click on the merge here and there's a confirmation message I'm clicking on ok so here you can see two records have been merged 
Now if you go back to the contacts module and search for Tony, you can see there's only one Tony because it's been merged. So this is how you apply the deduplication rule to avoid duplicates. So I hope it's clear. That's all for today's video. Thank you for watching.